Get your cameras ready. Tiffany Stratton is here. Beauty, grace, athleticism, and skill. Tiffy has it all. Making her way to the ring from Pryor Lake, Minnesota, Tiffany Stratton. Stratton has an amazing gymnastics background. She even competed on the U.S. national team. She sprang her way into WWE after that and has never looked back. We've learned very quickly that it's always Tiffy time in WWE. The EST is here. This is going to be good. And from Knoxville, Tennessee, Bianca Belair. I know she's early in her WWE career, but Bianca Belair already might be considered one of the best. And here's the thing. She's only going to get better. You're right, Cole. It's actually kind of scary how Belair continues to keep topping herself. The EST Bianca Belair always has such a big smile on her face. Well, that's just because Bianca hasn't realized you're down here yet. We're about to see arguably the strongest, the smartest, the fastest woman in this division today. And you won't get much argument from me, Mike. And into the count. Gets the shoulder up after one. Doesn't bow well if you still can't get more than a one count by now. Ow. Carefully measured knee. <laughs> Going for the ride. The fallaway slam. It couldn't have felt good being shucked around like that. Shoulder right to the midsection. Ooh, she responds with a counter. Placed in the corner. Face first into the turnbuckle. Oh, what a kick. She goes back inside the ropes. Ooh, she has bad intentions now. Removing the turnbuckle pad. All measured up. Drop kick to the back. Oh, reversal catches Tiffany. And a clothesline. She's rising back up on those wobbly legs. No! Somersault plunge out of the floor. Absolutely throwing all caution to the wind. Spinning in the face of danger. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Tiffany Stratton is still a relative newcomer to sports entertainment, still a somewhat unknown quality as far as competitors go. With that in mind, Corey, what do you think we can expect to see from her in this one? Well, Tiffany's been trained by the best people her daddy's money can buy, Cole, so obviously we can expect greatness. But on top of that, she also possesses a combination of impressive strength and athleticism that I'm sure we'll see in action here tonight. She heads out of the ring. Interesting strategy. Tiffany is being taken full advantage of now. Stratton's got to find a way to defend herself. Oh, a 
reminding her that she did not come here to play games. Here's the cover. cover. And she's not done yet. That's still a quick kick out at this point. Striking down with the axe handle. This match is wearing her down. Yeah, Belair was staking her claim as the EST there. With a glam slam. Bianca showing all of her power and athleticism. Those legs the other way up. Some might see that as a weapon, but a manager is just making sure the area is safe for her client. Makes the cover. And she's able to stop the count early. She's not done yet, but you have to believe that she's still in all sorts of trouble here. And you gotta think that this could be a mental hurdle for Bianca to overcome. Whip back into the ring. Look out! Oh! Just exhibiting their fearlessness. Exhibiting guts and accuracy as well. Oh. A match slam with some attitude. Trying to wrestle free their opponent's arm. Has the arm trapped. Goodness gracious. This match is coming down to the last second. Someone's got to get back to the ring now. Calls a double count out. Should have listened to the count. As far as Tiffany Stratton is concerned, she is the prettiest thing to ever happen in WWE. She thinks her presence alone drastically improves the quality of our broadcast. I mean, is she wrong? You have to admit, everything about Stratton really is pretty. From her clothes, to her hair, to her picturesque attacks, Stratton has worked hard to make sure she is the image of in-ring perfection. And she works hard to make sure she always gets what she wants, one way or another. And with Bianca Belair, we all know by this point what you're getting when the bell rings. As competitive as they come, and then some. That is just what happens when you are the EST of the company, Corey. Belair might make things like being the toughest or the fastest competitor in the ring look easy, but the effort she puts into competing cannot be discounted. Oh. Trying to target the back of the neck here. Oh! And now Bianca getting the crowd involved here. A manager grabbing anything under the ring is beyond unfair. It's just downright evil. If Bianca Belair wants to come out on top in this match, she only has to do one thing, and that's unleash her jaw-dropping power. As long as she puts everything she has behind her attacks, I think she can get it done here. Belair's physical abilities certainly are indeed impressive, Corey, and they could be the key to victory for her. No. Somersault plancha to the floor. It's like a heat-seeking missile coming at you. And the explosion occurring ringside. Throws her back in from ringside. Knees up, got the knees up at the last second. Catching a drop kick. Into the cover. She powers out immediately there. She is still very much in this. Would you look at this? She is removing. Oh, no. Now possibly setting up for a submission maneuver. Outright presentation of power there. Bianca. Be oh, serious peril. No, she counters. Yeah. Attempted at clothesline. Driven down STO. A number of clotheslines from Bianca. Bianca Belair with a strategically placed shot. This is just establishing dominance, followed by a stop. She slips outside. What has she got in mind? This is going to come down 
to who wants it more. Uh-oh. Thunderous powerbomb. And the EST got bested there. We all know what she's looking to do next. Watch out. Suicide dive. Soaring out of the ring, looking to do as much damage as possible. She throws her back in. Stratton hit pay dirt with that move. Putting her money. Tiffany Stratton. Not looking good for Bianca. Looking for the victory. Oh my God, did you see that? Kick out at one. That's, that's impossible. I, I can't believe what we just saw. And you see a perplexed look now for how such impactful offense couldn't gain a pinball. We have seen such a physical match from these combatants, and the wear and tear is starting to show. Now the time where the smartest competitor needs to take advantage of the situation. He needs to figure out the quickest way to end this. Oh, she has bad intentions now. Removing the turnbuckle pad. So to the stomach. Followed by the stomp. Her energy is fading rapidly now. Yeah, she's looking drained, Cole. I don't know how much is even left in her. Soaring, oh, body on body. Well, the ref doesn't even see the cover. Valuable seconds pass. And you know what that means? It means she probably has something even more devastating to finish her off with. Bianca Belair. K.O.D. Belair might have this in the back. Two. That's it. What an impressive win for Bianca Belair. This has to be a difficult loss for Tiffany Stratton. Bianca proving that she's still the EST of the WWE.